storing and disposing of waste materials. Clean air production helps companies to increase productivity, reduce production costs, use resources more efficiently, produce safer and better products and services, reduce levels of pollution and risk, improve company image. In spite of these successful approaches, there are still many barriers to the widespread adoption of cleaner production in the region. Barriers to implementing a cleaner production includes industries may not be aware of the potential of adopting preventive measures for reducing losses. Little information on the availability of appropriate technologies required for their specific purposes. Difficulties in accessing cleaner technology and external finance source. Cooperation of relevant research institute and academia is crucial in identifying expertise and resources available in the country. Lack capacity of financial institutions to assess merits of CP investment proposals. Industries are not willing to embark in cleaner production practice. There are common misconceptions about cleaner production. These misconceptions include cleaner production is difficult and expensive to implement. Cleaner production is technologically complicated and applies mostly to large companies. Cleaner production requires specialized skills and expertise. In reality, cleaner production is about preventing waste and minimizing damage to the environment. Cleaner production makes companies more profitable, improves products and services, lowers risk, improves companies' image by emphasis on environmentally sound investments and sustainable development, and makes companies more attractive as clients for banks due to improved cash flow and rapid return on capital or operating investments. Cleaner production is an option for environmental management that is available to business activities. It includes pollution prevention at source and the minimization of waste flows, which are alternatives that seek to avoid pollution generation as a preferable strategy to end of pipe treatment. Experiences from CP implemented at enterprises have shown that waste reduction, substitution, process optimization and other cleaner production options results in both better environmental performance and economic savings. So, make up your minds now. Promoting Cleaner Production the Department of Environment Malaysia has outlined three areas to get involved in activities of promoting cleaner production to further encourage the adoption of CP practices in the industrial and manufacturing environment as follows. Firstly, training and awareness programs. Secondly, cleaner production studies or demonstration projects. And thirdly, capacity building. Awareness campaign of cleaner production and environmentally sound technologies by the Department of Environment includes Seminar on promotion of environmentally sound technologies and cleaner production Conferences Workshops and Dissemination of information Related cleaner production activities undertaken by the Department of Environment involves the publication of a series of industry-specific handbooks for the five sectors, namely metal finishing, crude palm oil industry, raw natural rubber, food processing and textile manufacturing. In addition to this, the Department of Environment has also published Cleaner Production Blueprint for Malaysia, which will form the basis for future policy documents on the implementation of cleaner production practices in Malaysia. Cleaner Production Audit Guidelines was produced by the Department of Environment to give opportunities to the industries to enhance the efficiency of resource utilization and advocating waste minimization 
recycling and reuse a more cost-effective option to environmental regulatory compliance. Several demonstration projects in the specific small and medium industries sector such as textile, electroplating and food were successfully implemented and these success stories have been documented and published in the publication entitled Selected Success Stories on CP Implementation in Malaysia. CP promotion involves integrated course of actions such as raising of awareness, training, consultancies, enforcement of CP policies, advisory and research capabilities, capacity building not limited to department but participation from other agencies and private sectors. It is important as a leading organization which is directly involved in CP to have continuous program in capacity building. Officers from the Department of Environment is exposed and trained especially in cleaner production auditing. This will enable the department to form a group of cleaner production experts. Cleaner Production Virtual Center is a web-based application system designed to help inform and educate the public especially Malaysian industries of cleaner production opportunities available for their companies. Cleaner Production Virtual Centers contains a Cleaner Production Database Information System. It provides the definition of cleaner production, history, benefits, methodologist and much more. The center allows SMEs to gain information about financial support and trainings available in implementing cleaner production in their companies. It is a place to access cleaner production implementation tool or CPIT. The center also publishes success stories about companies which have implemented cleaner production. It publishes the latest news and events organized by the Department of Environment. The Cleaner Production Implementation Tool or CPIT is a web-based tool specially developed to help Malaysian SMI or SME to perform self-audit as part of preparation for cleaner production implementation in their activities. CPIT has three main audit modules which are Waste Audit, Energy Audit and Risk and Environment Audit. Waste audit means identifying sources and quantity of waste generated as well as to evaluate the information in order to generate cleaner production options. Energy audit is identifying sources and quantity of energy usage as well as to evaluate the information in order to generate cleaner production options for better energy conservations. Risk and Environment Audit is an assessment of potential risk, level of safety and impact to the environment due to activities in the plant. The Department of Environment Malaysia will continue its efforts and functions in clean air production programs. These include creating greater awareness and education of clean air production practices to industries. Guidelines preparation for clean air production based on specific sectors. Initiate clean air production activities in selected industries. Monitoring the progress of clean air production implementation and performance in industries. More training and exposure in clean air production assessment and auditing for DOE officers. Capacity building for stakeholders to facilitate smooth implementation of clean air production. Integrate cleaner production elements into existing laws and regulations. It is hoped that the Department of Environment will achieve greater success in its endeavor to promote cleaner production and clean technologies, thereby further improving the quality of life and enhancing the quality of the environment in Malaysia.